Hello everybody, my name is Katie and welcome back to my channel and for today's video I'm going to be doing a video about my experience getting the COVID vaccine and kind of like take you with me day by day of what I'm experiencing. Also, I really want to apologize for the terrible lighting. It is late at night and I'm filming this right before I go to bed and that is because I'm planning to do like an at the end of the day like synopsis of what happened throughout the day so today is saturday april 10th and i got my vaccine today i got the moderna and i got it at like 1 40 something or something like that um pm obviously and yeah i got it my left arm and so actually going in like the needle very much didn't hurt at all it was very tiny i barely even felt anything i honestly can't even remember if i felt anything at all and the whole process was like super simple just went in the room got the vaccine and then went into like a waiting area and waited 15 minutes and then i was able to go home and that was the end of that so yeah um i didn't really start feeling like any sort of soreness or anything until about 3.30, about 3.30, 3.45 is when I started to feel the soreness, but around an hour later is when for me, it got more intense. And I think that it's kind of remained at that like high intensity of soreness for me. Um, yeah, so moving it up to this point right here really hurts. So that's the only thing I've experienced today. I've just experienced soreness, that's it. I haven't experienced any sort of headache or fever or chills or anything yet and we're just gonna see what tomorrow brings. Um, so yeah, that's basically it for the first day and I will see you at the night of the second day for my check-in of what happened on Sunday. Hello everybody, it is the end of day two, so it is Saturday, nope, it is Sunday, April 11th, 2021, and I'm gonna tell you that the night of like last night, like going to bed and sleeping was rough. It was a rough one. I laid down and I couldn't get comfortable, like at all. Um, but I eventually fell asleep. And actually, when I think about it, I don't think I woke up in the night from any sort of pain or anything. So that's good. Um, when I woke up this morning though, I I actually slept in like 40 minutes later than I normally do. Normally I get up at eight. I slept until like 8.40. So yeah, I was tired, um, but yeah, I woke up and I was still pretty sore. Um, just like last night, I was very, very sore in my arm, but as the day progressed, I did notice that it started to get a little bit better because like I would say this morning, I could only raise it till about right here. Now I could do this with it just hurting ever so slightly. And actually today I had zero side effects, though literally the only thing was that my arm is really sore. And for like mm, 30 minutes, at around like 5 p.m. ish, my throat was a little sore, but I think that had to do with me talking a lot because I was on a FaceTime call with a friend. So yeah, I don't think that had to do with anything. But yeah, today was a very good day. I literally didn't have any side effects. Hoping the same for tomorrow. I feel like since I've got through day two though, I don't think anything's gonna happen day three, but we never know. People's bodies react differently to different things. And so we shall see, but that's it for my update for day two and I'll see you tomorrow. Hello everybody, it is the end of day three and today was so much better than yesterday was. I woke up this morning and I felt so much less sore, like, Look at this full rotation here. It doesn't feel flawless when I do that. It, I still feel it, but I would equate it more to like the feeling of a flu shot now more than anything, maybe even a little bit better than that. Um, yeah, I'm still a little bit sore, but honestly, like I can move. And so it's looking good here. No other symptoms today at all. Zero headache, zero chills, zero fever or zero whatever, like just soreness. And so, I guess I'll just see you again when I get my second dose because I feel pretty much almost perfect now. So yeah, there's not really much else to update. I will see you on my birthday. <laughs> okay, everybody. So it is time for my daily report. I got the vaccine today. I'm currently opening my notes. 
Um, I got the vaccine today at around 1.15 ish, 1.15 p.m. Um, going in, like the actual needle going in, it hurt a little bit more than the first time. Could be due to just the specific person that was like giving me my vaccine um, because, you know, different techniques, you know, different pain. Uh, so yeah, it hurt a little more going in. I definitely felt it. First one, I didn't feel it all. This one, I definitely felt it. Um, and for this, um, this dose, definitely I started feeling effects sooner than the first dose, um, but nothing like super crazy. Like just about like five minutes after I did feel it to get ever so slightly barely sore. Um, so I like totally like windmilled my arm and I was like moving it around like crazy. I also drink a lot of water, make sure to stay hydrated. Um, and around 3.45 to 4-ish, so about like a little over like three, three and a half hours later, almost four hours, um, I was feeling really tired. I was in the car at this point um, because I was out and it's my birthday today. Uh, so we went to a flower farm. If you haven't, oh wait, no, that's going out after this. I am posting a vlog. You can check it out if you want to later this month. Um, but yeah, so in the car on the way back home, I felt really tired, I presume from the vaccine. Uh, so I took a short nap. It was only about 15 minutes, but it, it was much needed. As of now, I feel fine. The only thing is that it's definitely considerably more sore than it was earlier today. Um, it is 10.45 p.m. by the way, I totally forgot to mention the time. Um, but I think at this point for my first dose, I was like telling you I can only move it up this high. Yeah, so moving it up to this point right here really hurts. I can totally move my arm up higher, it just hurts. Um, so yeah, I think that moving it around and drinking the water might have helped a little bit. Because um, I really didn't do that last time. So yeah, that's it for my update on the first day. I will see you back again tomorrow for my update on the second day, which I've heard is worse than the first day, um, or is actually the worst day, um, second dose, second day. So we'll see how I feel and if that experience is also true for me. Hello everybody, it is day two. My hair is kind of a mess because I got out of the shower about like an hour ago. Um, so I haven't brushed it or anything and it's still a little wet. Um, but I came here to do my update my arm update i know i forgot to mention yesterday i'm pretty sure um but i got the shot in my right arm this time i got it in my left arm the other time just to like i don't know balance it out <laughs> make things interesting um but today was generally i mean it was fine it wasn't as bad as i expected um because i know a lot of people like get chills or fever or whatever um but really my only symptoms were I was a little tired today. My I'm still quite sore, not as sore as the first time because of that windmilling I was doing. Um, but I did have some headache issues today. Around noon-ish, I had like a slight headache. It was starting to come on. It was more so just like an annoyance, but around like five-ish, the headache really became like an issue and it hurt quite a bit. Um, so I took some Tylenol to kind of help and that helped a lot. Um, now the headache is still there, but it's very faint. It's like kind of just back there. It's in the background, if that makes sense. So, um, but overall today wasn't that bad. It was fine. Like, you know, gotta do what you gotta do. Um, so I'll update again tomorrow. Tomorrow might be my last update, um, but we shall see. So yeah, see you tomorrow. Hello everybody, it is actually the next morning. It is, what's today? May 11th um, at 9.37 a.m. I realized that I forgot to update you last night, so I'm doing it right now. Basically last night, I mean yesterday just in general, I was pretty fine, like I could move my arm like totally fine. I even worked out yesterday. Um, today, same deal. I think this is gonna be last of my updates because I'm feeling pretty much normal. I really just only felt like a teensy bit tired yesterday, but I don't even know if that's like from a side effect or just because I'm tired. <laughs> like, I don't know. 
but yeah that basically concludes this journey thanks for coming along with me throughout this month it's been a month and a day so yeah thank you for watching if you're able to get vaccinated please do so we can reach herd immunity yeah i hope you all have a lovely day um i know summer break is kind of coming up for people so enjoy your summer break and if you have one <laughs> and i'll see you back again next sunday for another video bye